What's happening people says welcome back to another video So today I'm back at Lanishan High School Lanishan Lanishan We have got the art block Stay well to do it's a real glum area of the school but we've had ten hundred mating wall prepper he's been in prepped all my walls off back over to help ten hundred now we're ready to start painting we're gonna be doing portraitures of famous artists so we've got Savio Dali, Rita Carlo and then a couple of other ones I don't know I can't remember them all off the top of my head but there's a few so we're gonna start with Savio Dali uh, and move away up and up and up and up and up and around. Add a bit of colour to this area. And uh, and it starts the day, one of five days. Let's go. So, I have got another two more portraits done. Didn't capture a lot on the camera today because I was just trying to work out what the heck I'm actually doing because the plans for this actually changed last minute to paint inside of you. Uh, we're supposed to be painting the building outside. Just flipped over to doing this. Obviously, no prep work or anything like that come into it. But we've got a lot done. We've got Keshi Marakami here. He's looking pretty fantastic. Then on this big wall then we've got Andy Warhol going on. I've got a mark out of stencil tonight or tomorrow night. We've got Savio Dali. Then we have Grayson Perry. Normally does, he's quite eccentric. Van Gogh appears. And then we've got Rita Carlo here. But uh, they're all marked out. Tomorrow is a big day of filling. Then Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, refine everything. And I've got four more days to get it all done. But day one is normally like this. We mark everything out and uh, we go on from there. So I'll see you. In about three, two, one, and it'll be tomorrow. So yeah, we are back for day two, and uh, we are gonna get this filled in, this filled in, that filled in, some more other fills in, and that filled in, and we're all gonna get it all filled in, and then we can start refining and getting the design done, and all that stuff. So uh, let's get this uh, Savio Dali going. really smelly in here now. Tomorrow, get in, Rita Carlo is gonna be first. Then it's gonna be uh, Grace and Perry. Divide this back wall up some point tomorrow, and then try to get all of that wall finished. So Van Gogh looks a bit scary at the minute, but you look cool when it's in. I just need to get a little bulk of the color in. Now it's, God, it's boggy in here. Now that all that is all done, I can then concentrate on getting the actual figures uh, the artist's face is complete. But yeah, phew. I need to get out of here. Let's go. See you tomorrow. So this is day three, make or break day. I've got three big portraits to put in. I've got six hours to get these three faces painted and up. So I've got a lot to do in one day. Let's go. Wow, that was actually a lot harder than I thought. So I started that at 1 p.m. It is now 20 past four. Three hours to do that. It was a lot harder than actually doing a realistic looking painting. Next thing you do is bulk out the Andy Warhol wall ready for tomorrow when I'm gonna get the stencils. So I'm gonna hand over the screen and we're gonna be in my house. So, we are at my house. I have some acetate, which is some clear plastic. I have two sheets of it to put together, and I'm gonna make a Campbell soup 
stencil and this is the process. I'm gonna cut out all the big bits out of this stencil. Then I got some other sheets then, which I'm gonna get all the smaller pieces. But then when it comes to actually painting it, big stencil on first, all the little stencils in between, and they'll all have little markers where all the stencils need to line up. Let's get marking out and let's get cutting. different stages to stencil art. 4.30 now, it's taken me near enough all day to get that done, but I wanna get Grayson Perry done today and maybe a little bit more on this wall, so then there's a lot less to do on the last day, which is Friday. So there's a lot to do in the next day and a bit. So, let's quit jibber jabbing, get on with it. Day five, last day. Uh, I just want to explain quickly how I got all these flowers, all the same size. What I do is do a little drawing on some paper, then cut out some little slots in the line work, and then spray that onto the wall. Then it leaves you like a dotted line effect like this, and then you can copy it and get all your shapes all the same size. So yeah, a little tip there. I'm gonna get this wall all marked out now, ready for bulking and painting. So let's go. Just need to sign the work and it's done. Wow. Hope you guys enjoyed this painting. It's been a mammoth of a task to get it done. I've enjoyed every single second of it. And congratulations to the people in your 7C for winning our little giveaway that we did here at the school. Yeah, and if you did like this piece, make sure you like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.